qué tipo de comida viene? The bread is very moist. Extremely spicy. Mexican ice cream. Long time no see. Hola amigos, welcome back to my channel. I'm in front of Macado Leperta, which is also known as Macado San Juan de Dios, which is <laughs> the largest Indo market in Latin America. I've been to a few markets in Mexico and let me gonna find out why this market is so special besides it is the biggest in Latin America. From what I can see, it has two floors. The first floor is mostly for food, and the second floor is for clothing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Tons of things to eat. Oh my goodness. I think partial of the first floor is for clothing and accessories as well. But let's check out the second floor first. Um, it has a lot of um, jeans, um, sports clothing, and I think shoes as well. Um, I believe I'm in the sports section. <laughs> I saw quite a lot of brand name, but I'm not quite sure if they of them are real. The other part of the second floor, it has some CD-ROM, um, computer stuff, and of course, the DVD. <laughs> I'm sorry, I should be wrong. It has three floors, like one, two, three. Mostly, if you would like to have a massive selection of clothing and everything, you need to go to an outdoor market. <laughs> now it is 11 a.m. I think it's still it's quite early so a lot of shops are not open let's go downstairs and take a look so this is the um, second floor <laughs> you can see um, there's a lot of uh, watches accessories yeah tons of them I cannot film directly on the stuff because <laughs> I don't want to get killed <laughs> tell me why we still need the wash right now we have a phone I'm at the perfume zone there are tons of perfume you can get some cosmetics and some cooking stuff and toys <laughs> get your Louis Vuitton coach. You can also get a speakers, um, radio. Wow, that's a lot of DVD on the second floor. This is the food court area. It's still early. Not too many people. Japanese food here, yeah, really interesting, huh? Oh, sushi? A ramen? Tiene ramen? Ramen, claro. Tengo de distintos tamaños. Tengo chico. Tengo ramen. Ah, qué bueno. Sí, gracias. Ah, voy a regresar. Sí, muchas gracias. Hey, no kidding. There's a few food for Japanese food. Hola. What's here? What type of food is here? Japanese. Japanese. Is Japanese? No. What is this? Oh yeah, the Mexican music. Go. No, ahorita, uno o dos horas después. Ah, sí, está bien. Muchas gracias. Pedria es one of the famous cuisine in Guadalajara. 
I should have the birria or salsa ahogada. I only have one tiny stomach. If you are looking for something to eat, you will go for a place that has a lot of people or not too many people. Everyone is just sitting right next to each other and eat. I'm just a little bit concerned. Look at this Chinese food here too. This one make it like a restaurant. It looks so comfy. Massive, massive, massive. This is a massive mugger. This is such a good place to hang out during rainy season. Oh, finally, some leather shoes, leather jacket, and lots of cowboy hats. This part is more peaceful. Something for the horse. Wow, this is absolutely beautiful. Need to get some school bag for your kids. But everyone is doing online school now. Who needs a school bag? Traditional outfit. It's so pretty. The dresses are absolutely beautiful. But I don't think <laughs> I'm able to wear them. I just like my jeans and my running shoes. This is for the mariachi. Wow. I wonder why all the dresses have those tiny little waistline cutting. But this is Mexico. So it has a little half outdoor area. And in the middle, that's a tree. I have a station later, I might buy a pair of leather boots. It looks so cool. Some more. All of them are shoes. I think that's for souvenir, right? Keychain. Remember to wash your hands. Here is for boots. And Robert? Wow. Seriously. Oh my god. Mexican ice cream. Long time no see. This is um, mame. This one is not just ice and then with the taste of fruit. You can also eat the fruit as well. Mexican ice cream. It's the best. Let's check out some Christmas stuff. A lot of Christmas decoration. Those are Jesus. During Christmas, churches or even families, they might set up their little manger. Then they put the little Jesus in between the manger. Um, at 12 a.m. on Christmas Day, it means that Jesus is born. Souvenir. This place is huge. I just get lost. I need to find my way back to the food court and I need to get some groceries too. Crazy, there's more food here. Two of them are focus. vegetables but what should I cook when you buy vegetables make sure you get a basket to put everything in glasses and all this place is more like a local shopping mall where people come to eat and shop um, instead of doing groceries or is that for tourists to come and get souvenir? Bakery without any cover. I was wrong. There's a lot of fruits here. I just bought this um, grapes. 
if you want to walk up and down, it's not necessary to take the stairs because you can just go around the building like me. Look at that. <laughs> This is one of the um, famous dishes in Guadalajara, torta ahogada. Torta basically means the um, sandwich, ahogada means drunk. <laughs> You can find tota everywhere in Mexico, but this is the first time I see tota avocada, which is the tota in the sauce. <laughs> some lime juice. Ooh. The bread is very moist. Oh, by the way, in case you wonder what kind of meat it is, um, I think it should be pork. <laughs> the guy gave me this sauce to put into the tota. Oh. The sauce is extremely spicy. Guys, can you tell me your favorite dish in Guadalajara? I picked this restaurant because it has different places and for customers to eat, so I don't have to be right next to another person. Look, that area belongs to the same restaurant. And this is my area. Oh, I got everything done. Okay guys, this is Macano San Juan de Dios in Guadalajara, Mexico. If you like this video, could you give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time. Bye!